what can be so rewarding after coming out of a long-term protective hairstyle yeah your guess is as good as mine um in today's video i'll be sharing with you how i washed my hair after coming out of three months long-term protective hairstyling like i've been carrying my mini twist for three months like back to back i retweet i still keep them in the same form so but today i'm done with taking down my hairstyle and i have a video of my takedown process like guys you want to watch that before you come to this video so i'm going to leave a link in the description for you to see that so i already did a paper treatment that is my very first step before i ever shampoo my hair so i have a video of that also i did an oil rinse um, on my hair so you want to go watch that i have a video of that also i'll leave a link as well in the description box and so what i did is just to go in with my shampoo i make my own shampoo i have my um diy uh, black soap shampoo which i've been using and so what you see me do is applying it to my scalp because i'm concentrating more on my scalp so even though i've been washing my hair um over the course of these three months in my mini twist this feels different because my hair is loose and my scalp has not gotten this much exposure to shampoo ever since i went on my protective hairstyling if you know what i mean so washing my hair in its loose form is like very very rewarding is intense and this is how i take care of my hair after coming out of a long protective hairstyle so after coming out of a long term protective hairstyle your hair may look dull it may look frizzy it may look matted together of course at the root especially so this is where you want to make sure that you're taking good care of your hair by shampooing your hair like real good and here is one of the ways i feel washing your hair um helps to improve hair growth because um in this video or as i always do i use hot water not too hot just enough that i can bear to wash my hair because it helps to remove all the products that have accumulated in my scalp and um, all the products that have been stuck to the roots of my mini twists when I was um, still carrying my protective hairstyle. You know, when you shampoo your hair in twists, sometimes it's difficult to tell if all the products have gone out of your hair. You might still have some product buildups at the roots of your uh, protective hairstyle like in my case in my mini twist so it helps me to remove product accumulation from my scalp from my hair strands so that i can be able to hydrate my hair properly and moisture can penetrate my hair shaft this is the foundation guys of any form of moisture you want to put into your hair it starts from wash day So your wash day will determine how the rest of your week is going to go, guys. So you want to make sure to take your time to remove all those dirt, all those product build up. Because if you don't do that, your hair may not be able to accept any more moisture into it. And as you can see, I wash my hair twice. I always wash my hair twice. So the first um shampoo is to remove all the product build up you know i leave it for a while before raising it off you know just to cleanse my scalp then the second shampoo is to cleanse my hair and also any other leftover products on my hair so this is what i call intense hydration like my hair feels so hydrated and i also consider my wash day as a way to improve hair growth because take your hair for instance as a plant your scalp is the soil if you don't feed your soil right if you don't water it there is no way you can be able to produce you know fresh leaves fresh hair growth hair strands you cannot breed 
you cannot produce good and healthy hair strands so you have to treat your scalp right and it's only on wash days that you get to do that so after rinsing that off i'm going ahead to do my intense protein treatment so what i always use is egg i use two eggs in this case some uh i think a spoon of honey and then some of my hair growth oil inside it so most times i like to mix that up with any of my deep conditioner but in this case i'm going raw like guys i'm going raw i'm using it raw in its raw form like seriously my hair needed a protein treatment so i'm doing this because um i need some form of strength as i'm applying moisture i'm also applying strength to my hair so after doing this i'm going to also cover it up leave it for like 10 to 15 minutes and then i wash it off but one thing you should know is that you have to follow up with a moisturizing deep conditioner after your protein treatment now i know there are lots of protein treatments out there there are some products like the afoji and the rest but i have always talked with my own old school method like i know taking in your eggs like eating them is the best way but i can't afford to add some weight just by eating eggs you know every day or every other day so i like to just put them on my hair in its raw form so I've been doing this for years like since i started my hair growth journey like anytime i just feel like i needed some real protein treatment instead of going out to get the store bought ones i prefer to use my eggs because of course your eggs contain protein so this is not to say that you should do the same thing if you can get some good hair products that contains protein of course by all means do that but this is just my style at least for now after this you need to do follow up with a deep conditioner so i'm going to show you guys how i use my deep conditioner in my next video because i don't want to make this video a long one and i'm also going to be trying out a new deep conditioner so i want you guys to really see that i'm going to be doing some testing and i want you guys to see that so i'll continue that in the next video but this is just my own protein treatment for now because it helps with my hair's elasticity it helps to give my hair strength so i just go for it all the way so this is a full wash day you know routine after coming out of a three month long protective styling and trust me guys you want to care for your hair the way you want your hair to care for you like you want your hair to give you feedback with um good hair threads healthy hair and strength and elasticity and all those good stuff so thank you guys for watching i'll catch you guys in my next video where i'll be showing you my new deep conditioner that i'll be trying out and how everything went if you're yet to subscribe to my channel please hit on that subscribe button like this video share this video and i'll see you guys in my next one bye bye